There's like mold on it. <laughs> oh, it's not going to focus. Oh, well. But you know what I mean. Um, so there's that one. Um, I don't even know how these like makeup artists makes all these videos. Hey, it's me. <laughs> So hi guys, um, welcome to my channel. Um, this is going to be my first video I'm going to be uploading. Um, yeah, wish me all the best. Um, well, to start off with, my name is Ahmed, I'm from Bristol. Um, know, some of you will probably know me from my Instagram, Ahmed.BossFan. I'll link it down in the um, description below. Some of you might know me from my other Instagram, Custard Donuts. Uh, be sure to like, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff. And then, yeah, at the moment I don't know what sort of videos I'm going to be uploading, but this video is going to be sort of like a um unboxing video as a beginning sort of video i was gonna do like an unboxing i got a package here um that's for me yeah and i got another one it's basically two cameras i bought just to get me going with the whole youtube sort of business well i say business well the whole youtube business well you know what i mean yeah i got two cameras so i'm gonna start with the smaller package i think the guy that delivered it had sort of already ripped it open yeah that's a bit of crap but yeah so I start opening it I bought I didn't buy nothing special because like I thought I didn't want to buy like a really expensive camera so you get really expensive ones but obviously that's a lot of money in it and I didn't really want to fork out like four or five hundred pound on a like vlogging camera so I bought something really basic I bought two um so you get like multiple angles obviously I don't know how it's all going to turn out with YouTube in it so if if like the channel doesn't take off and like it, I don't actually enjoy doing the videos I didn't want to have to like fork out a lot of money and then like be stuck with something does that make sense but this is the first camera I've got I don't know if it holds it the right way around but I've got a Lumix um, Panasonic Lumix TZ55 um, this one I bought second hand I don't know I just didn't really want to spend a lot of money at the moment um, if um, the channel does pick up um, inshallah I will, I will be getting like a better camera but I don't know we'll see I didn't want to go out and then for example if I don't actually enjoy it um but yeah so um this is the if i just show you again um it's got like 40 40 times um intelligent zoom with 20 times optical zoom um i'm a big fan of like large um zoom cameras we've got like a massive like i don't know if it's a dslr or, like bridge camera i don't know which one it is um but that one's got like 40 times zoom but um size wise it's like really big so um to like carry around for vlogs and stuff like that it would have been a bit impractical so i didn't really want to use that one obviously that's the home camera as well so if something happens to it um whilst i'm using it um i didn't want to sort of be responsible for it um yeah this one the guys the guy lived local um but he said he didn't want to come deliver it and I, I couldn't go to go pick it up um but it basically had all the um it was boxed as you can see it came with the chargers um the genuine original um Panasonic charger um, and yeah came with a nice little pouch as well so you can carry it around um, I'm not too keen on these strap type ones but I, I'll probably take the straps off um, so I've got just the camera case so to speak so I could just put that in my bag or something I don't know we'll see we'll keep it in the car or something but yeah I've never used I've not opened the camera before so I'm not sure what to expect but um, this is what it looks like um, the reason I chose this one um, I would say the price but like I think I've told my mom something else so I think I'm gonna keep the price um quiet should we say oh there's my cat but yeah um yeah so this is the camera the reason I chose this one is because it was like I've, I've seen I've read a lot of the reviews of it um and there was a lot of good reviews um yeah that's probably why the only, oh yeah no, no no the second reason it's got like the flip flip screen so if you so when you're on like selfie mode so like when you're vlogging and all that um you can see oh something just drove past but um yeah so this is that one so it's got a screen let's see if it turns on um i don't know how to turn it on okay so yeah basically the on off button there so i'll press that oh the lens come out oh it works to be honest I, i'm not expecting this to work at all so because i bought it second hand i don't know i don't know what to expect at the moment but yeah you can see it's working um the screen works which is quite cool oh no that's cool oh the zoom works as well now that's pretty decent you know it says all right cool yeah so um i've just tried it um it seems to be working so it's working normal and then if i flip the screen 
you can see it's also flipped the screen in the video um, so you can sort of see where what the camera is facing so if I was to turn it around and start doing vlogs I can actually see you guys uh, this feels weird I don't know do I look at the lens or do I look at the screen but yeah I don't know that's quite cool actually I like that um, so if we turn that off flip that down this one's got Wi-Fi as well which I suppose is quite cool so you can like you can instantly upload everything yeah so but, oh it's got like a mini HDMI slot as well so um, condition wise this actually seems like pretty brand new um, but yeah so it's got like the charging port over there as well as the mini HDMI um, yeah it's got the tripod mount so I'll probably be using it on a selfie stick or something or tripod depending on what I'm filming if we're filming at home then I will be using a tripod but then if I'm gonna start doing vlogs I don't know yet I've got no idea what I'm gonna be doing at the moment um, but yeah that's that it didn't come with a memory card but I'm not bothered because I've got a few coming as well um, I was gonna do the video when I got everything for my um, sort of YouTube stuff um, but yeah they obviously haven't arrived yet so and then I was just really eager to start filming so didn't really bother waiting for it but yeah it came with two batteries here's the original genuine one that um, came with the factory Panasonic oh is it focusing oh it's not gonna focus oh well. but you know what I mean um, so there's that one and if we put that one in and close it locks and yeah it's done and then he, he also said he's got a spare battery which is quite cool which is quite handy I suppose so if, you, if I do end up going out or somewhere um, I can always have a spare battery with me so that's this one yeah so that just fits in the case and I think I will be taking these straps off I'm not too keen on them it's not for me it just makes it feel like a naughty thing something like I don't know you know like you have like school kids with their water bottles around their neck I don't know it's not for me I don't like it but yeah I mean the box was a bit damaged but second hand um and for the price it was really cheap um I, I bought it on ebay actually um so it's good it's got 16 megapixel it's got panorama view obviously it's got the wi-fi mode that's that one there oh yeah um i bought obviously second hand cameras but my mum wasn't too keen on me buying it because obviously with corona and all that um she was like what if someone's got it this that the other oh yeah this is the parcel um for the other one the guy obviously bought something on amazon prime and then just sent it on the box oh yeah i i have no idea how to ev edit videos so i i could have just like edited the address bit out but didn't have a clue how to do that so i just like spanned it with like loads of duct tape there's like hundreds of layers and in the certain light like you can still see the word there like a part of the address but oh well it is what it is it is what it is it is what it is um but basically yeah let's open this Oh, we gave loads of packaging, like, that's nice, but a lot of mess now that i got to tidy up. But, you know, packaging-wise, is just wrapped in bubble wrap. I don't know what to expect for this one, because he never had any, like, original pictures on the advert. He said, um, he said it's in good condition. Like, I don't know. I bought on eBay. It's one of those blind buys I've done. I bought, well, it's for YouTube, just to see what happens. Again, like, to be honest, I'm not expecting any of this to actually work, but... Oh well, I haven't told my mum yet. Oh, he sent like a brand new charger, which is quite cool. Um, yeah, I've got loads of these anyway, but yeah, that was nice. Um, the pouch looks dead. I don't know, it just looks a bit saggy. And there's a lot of shit on it. Oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna throw the case away. I don't like it. It's dirty. It's like mold on it. Oh. <laughs> That's nasty. That's probably why my mum says don't buy anything secondhand. It's got like a zip pocket. If I was to wash this, I'd probably keep it, but I don't know if I'm going to wash it. Like, what if it breaks in the washing machine or something? But yeah, um, it's got a pouch. So this one, again, like if i got a spare battery, I can buy um, if I get hold of one. Um, yeah, I tried to... Actually, I don't know. I might just buy a new case. I'm not too keen on this one. It looks a bit dead. So yeah, that's that on the floor. Um, it's got like dust on it. I don't know if that's like dirt or just I don't even know but let's just hope it's not like contaminated with anything um but yeah this one's a Samsung I don't know the specs on this one at all either much 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 later oh it's a Samsung WB150 I don't know is it gonna pick it up um I don't even know how these like makeup artists makes all these videos like it's not even focusing this is so stupid like but that's like so stupid like why isn't it picking out but then maybe that's what you get when you have a shit phone 
So yeah, at the moment I'm only filming on my, I got like a crappy GoPro that I used on one of my track days. And I, at the moment I'm just generally filming on my um, Galaxy S8. Um, but yeah, so let's see if this one turns on. Oh, he's got a battery as well. Um, is it a genuine one though? I think the slider is broken, maybe? But yeah, it's, the battery's not coming out. Maybe he's broke it, that's why you're selling it so cheap. Nah, it's not coming out. So like, imagine this camera dies, or if it don't even turn on. What if I can't replace the battery? Oh, it's coming out. Oh, that's good. It is a genuine Samsung battery, which is quite cool. Which is a good sign, I guess. Because if it's not got the genuine battery, then that generally means that battery's been replaced. Maybe he's had problems before. And, oh, it came with a memory card as well. Kingston 8GB memory card. It's a class 4, so it's not the best, but, I mean, 8GB, that'll get me going for a bit. I mean, I got some 16GB ones coming anyway, but I bought them on Amazon, so they should be coming tomorrow, I think, inshallah, um, from Amazon Prime. But yeah, Amazon Prime is good, you know, like, I use it all the time, but, oh, this one's not even turning on. Oh, it's on. So it does turn on. Hey, it's me. <laughs> uh, Alright, cool. So this one, um, yeah, it turns on. This one, condition-wise, is alright as well. It's not too bad. Um... Yeah, it's alright. So if I just run through the specs on this one, again, like, I don't know nothing about cameras, like, it's just a camera to me. I thought you'd just take photos, isn't it? Okay, so it's like 18 times zoom and like 14 megapixels. I don't know if that's like even being picked up by the camera. So there's that one there, and then um, like the 18 times zoom. I don't know if you can see that, but cool. So yeah, if I just get the other one again. So the other one was uh, 20 times zoom. So this one's got 18. I know this one I liked a little bit more than Lumix because it had the flip screen, which um, for vlogging and all that is a million times better. Um, it also had more of megapixels. This one had 16 megapixels, um, whereas the Samsung is only got um, 14 megapixels. Um, it doesn't seem to have the HDMI. It's only got like the micro sort of USB Samsung charger for charging it. Um, so yeah, like side by side, um, I don't know. They're both quite cool, to be honest. Um, obviously, you've just seen that this one's a lot faster, the Lumix, the Panasonic one, whereas the Samsung one took like a bit of time to think about it. Um, okay, so basically, initial thoughts. The Panasonic just feels much better quality-wise. The Samsung is a bit meh. Just Maybe that's just like to do with that the Panasonic 16 megapixel and the other one's 14. But the Panasonic build-wise, it feels a lot stronger and rugged. Um, and another thing, in terms of the modes that the cameras have got, the um, Panasonic one has got a lot more modes at the top than the Samsung one has got. To me, none of their modes mean anything. Um, some of them seem to have similar ones, but the Panasonic one does have a lot more modes. And on, on the main face, they got a lot more buttons as well, the Panasonic one. So to me, that means is better maybe. Sometimes more is less, less is more. I don't know. No, no, shut up. <laughs> that makes no sense. But do you know what I mean? I don't know. But yeah, so that's that one. In terms of comfy to hold, I think the Samsung one's a little bit nicer to hold. Um, if you see, it's got that little ridge over here. So it's just nicer to hold when you're holding it. So yeah, that's quite cool. Um, on the other hand, the Panasonic's got like a, only a slim sort of ridge over here. So when you're holding it, it just feels a bit like a brick. It's not that too comfy. I don't know, when you do flip it around, yeah, again, it's not, it's, it's not, it's not the most comfortable to hold. But I suppose when you're using it, normal, it's not too bad. But um, yeah, for um, general holding facing forward, the Samsung I find is much more um, better to hold, much more comfortable. But yeah, that was like a quick um, initial thoughts of um, the two cameras I just bought price wise. Um, I'm not going to say specifically what I bought them for because then I think I told my mum something else. So we'll have to see about that. <laughs> um, yeah. Let me know in the comment section what sort of videos you want me to be putting up and then I'll see if I can get some stuff filmed. At the moment, I don't have a clue what sort of videos I'm going to be putting up. Uh, maybe some sort of challenges. I've been looking at the ramen noodle challenges. They look quite cool. But I'm going to have like a test run with my sister, see how it goes. And then, I don't know, we'll, we'll probably film it. And then, because I've got the cameras now, so we can have one set up on this angle, one set up that angle. Yeah. And then, after that, I don't know what I'm going to be filming. Maybe some vlogs, like, because of lockdown and all that. Um... But yeah, let me know what sort of videos you want to see. And then I'll try to get something lined up. Also, yeah, thanks for watching if you stayed this long into the video. Yeah, it's much appreciated. Um, yeah, <laughs> I don't actually know what to say now. But yeah, um, 
I'll be linking my um, social medias in the description box. I'll put my Instagram, both of my Instagram accounts. And then, yeah, be sure to subscribe, like the video if you um, liked it. Drop a comment down, let me know what you thought. Anything I can improve. Um, I'll probably be filming in the house again, but I'm not sure yet because I got my siblings at home from... Because obviously they can't go to school at the moment because of lockdown. So I will be filming in the car or something. Because um, obviously I got... I don't want them to like run in, like say something really stupid and embarrassing. So then like, it ruins the whole video. So um, yeah, so I won't be doing that anytime soon. I don't know, we'll have to see. But yeah, thanks for watching. And yeah. Thank you.